guys, welcome back to my channel. In case you're new here, my name is Ashna Ko, and here we do makeup and beauty. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and give this a like. And if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I upload every week. And let's get started. So today I'm going to be using this Morphe 35M palette. And here are the beautiful colors. I'm leaning more into a purple look with this darker, darker one. So um, I already went ahead and did my eyebrows and I did um, my base. I'm gonna go in with a, a fluffy brush and start packing that on, on my lid. And then once I don't have a lot of product, I'm gonna go ahead and move it up. some of this shade just so that it won't be really dark of a purple and I'm gonna apply it on top and also blend it out I want a more of a pinky purple uh, look not a dark purple With a clean brush, I'm gonna go over on top so that it can blend it out a little further. You gotta continue to blend and blend and blend and blend and blend so that it can look seamlessly. Okay, now that we look like we have bruised eyes, I'm gonna get a wipey. I'm gonna get a wipe and just wipe off the, the bottom. I'm gonna warm up some concealer on my hand and then I'm gonna cut the crease halfway only, not the whole crease. Now I'm gonna go in with this shade right here in the corner. It's this light shade, it's like a cream color shade. And I'm just gonna pack that on the, um, on where I cut the crease. Let's hope it's not too dark. Ok 
Okay, I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. And I'm gonna put a little bit next to, like right in the middle to blend the, the lighter shade with the darker shade. I'm gonna try this glitter liner I have. I have this glitter liner I bought a while back and it's a purple shade and it's it has, I don't know if you guys can see, uh, it says Italia and it has a little horse on it. Um, there's actually uh, sh some shops downtown um, that that sell like makeup and actually there i found the um the la girl pro concealers and they have a bunch of other makeups um they have a uh, other products so maybe maybe one day in the future i'll head over downtown and record a little of what they have and Get, get a couple of things and maybe do a video on that. Um, so let me try this out, this liner. I've never really uh, used it, but let me give it a try. See how it, it looks outlining the white. The glitter actually looks really nice, um, but my hand's not really sturdy. So what I'm gonna do to help, um, I'm gonna go back in with that light shade that we used on the crease. And wherever I felt like I over uh, did it or it was too thick of a line, I'm gonna go ahead and, and just, um, I'm just gonna uh, apply product so it can thin it out. All right, guys, mama's got mommy duty, so uh, let me stop right here and I'll be right back, okay? I am back. Baby's fed, baby's in sleeping, and I'm back to my makeup. Okay, so. Okay. So I think this is it for the eyes. Okay, so I'm gonna do my base next, and um, I wanted to try something different. I have the LA Girl Pro Concealers, and I have this reddish one, and I've heard that if you put it under, like, if you put it anywhere where there's redness, I mean, where there's darkness, like, uh, say, under eyes, I have really dark under eyes, so I want to see if it would cancel out. And I can, and you won't really see it with the makeup. So let me go ahead and give it a try. All I'm gonna do is just put a little and then spread, spread it with the brush. I'm gonna add some powder onto the onto the red to set it so it won't be moving when I add the the foundation.
Okay, I'm just setting my face um, with the translucent powder. I saw this girl I follow on Facebook. Facebook. Her name is Rocio Alvarado and um, she said all her face with the translucent powder. She said it was to set it and then when you apply your um, your powders and everything's set. But I'm gonna give it a try and see how I like it. Because I've always heard that you're not supposed to set all the face. You're supposed to set only where you um, you applied like the highlight and and then you contour you like bronze or contour and I don't know so I'm gonna give it a try and, and see how I like it and maybe maybe if I like it I'll just um, I'll do that but like I said everyone has their own techniques and everyone does it all different and I'm just showing the way um, I do it and I'm using also other people's techniques. So whatever works for everyone. You just do you. Okay, I'm gonna just wipe it off. really try to upload the video today I'm gonna see how it goes guys I'm gonna see um, if I can upload this video I had already filmed something before this but um, me salió todo, me salió nomás la frente. my forehead was the only thing you can see so I didn't like it so I had to refilm it and I'm filming it the day that I want to put it up and it's hard to do that uh, film and uh, edit on the same day because I do have a baby I have to take care of all day until he goes to sleep at around maybe six or seven. So, um, I mean, as long as I, I put up a video today because that's what I want to do. Um, let me continue so I can finish and I can edit. Mm, okay, so let me go on to, 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 to. Okay, I'm gonna apply my lashes and I'll be right back. Okay, okay, I'm back. Um, next off, we're gonna do the lower lash. I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. No. This shade right here, sorry. I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. And then with the smaller brush, I'm gonna go in with the darker uh, purple.
for fun, I think I'm going to use this liquid velvet lip gloss. It's just lip gloss, but I think it's a matte. Well, this is one of the products that I bought also um, when, I, when I went to that store downtown. And um, I figured why not? I mean, I'm already doing a purple look. Some of this shade. Wait. I'm gonna be using. Alright, guys. 